Christmas is all about. Good morning, guys. I just feel like I look so festive and just so pretty right now. I'm coming out here real fast because I just wanted to let you guys know that this video is actually filmed after the next video that will go up tomorrow. It seems a little bit out of order. Certain things might just seem a little off. I filmed a Thanksgiving vlog, but I actually decorated my apartment for Thanksgiving, but I just felt like it made more sense for me to upload my Thanksgiving video, the video that you're about to watch right now, before I upload my Christmas decor. I wanted this video to go up a little bit earlier but with finals, me being sick, it's just a whole lot, a whole lot. Of, I didn't get it up as early as I wanted it to and then tomorrow you will get my Christmas decor video and then you'll get my Christmas tree video and you're disrespectful. That's very rude. I'm about to go up. I love you guys and thank you for watching. You guys are so excited. All right so All right, so today's Thanksgiving. I have been tasked with making the macaroni and cheese for my family. Now, I know how to cook, and I cook for myself, and I cook for my boyfriend, but I've never really cooked for my family. Like, this is the first time, and I'm making the mac and cheese. So I'm very nervous, like, extremely. I know I can do it. I've made it before. I'm just nervous that they're just going to be so judgy of me. I'm like, that ain't the way that mom do it, but okay. Feel you like it's just you're so used to like mac and cheese and mac and cheese is like a staple. So my siblings are looking at me like you're given this task of making the macaroni and cheese. I don't even know if you can cook. So if you don't make it right, we ain't got no macaroni and cheese and it's not Thanksgiving. Like we only get macaroni and cheese on holidays. That's, that just is what it is. So if we don't have macaroni and cheese, what are we doing? I just woke up. If I look hit, don't mind my finger. And I went to work this week. And if you didn't know, I work at a preschool when I'm at home. Yeah, I, I sliced my finger open the first day back and it was still bleeding yesterday. And I sliced it on Monday. And today is Thursday, obviously, because it's Thanksgiving. But you know, it is what it is. Hi, my name is Kira. I go by K here. Welcome to my channel for those of you who are new. And let's go ahead and head downstairs so we can start making this macaroni cheese. I'm also scared and nervous because my mom is down there. So I feel like she's going to be over my shoulders. But we're going to pull through. I, I believe in us. Do you believe in us? I, I believe in us. We got our comfy pajamas on. These are actually so cute. It just says chill out. And I got them from Walmart. Can you believe they were only $20? Yeah. If I can find it, I'll link it down below. It is currently, it is 9.39. Yeah, now we're gonna actually head downstairs so we can start cooking. Good friend of mine. Help me realize something. Good morning, Haley. This is my naked dog. Oh, why is it naked? Oh my God. Mm -hmm. Now freeze on now, ready? What you finna cook? Your famous mac and cheese. I ain't never had none, so I don't know if it's famous or not. Hello, Kira. Can I help you because I like helping people? Good. Girl, your your dog head is shedding. It does. He's breaking out. He's breaking out. Yeah. He's breaking out with it. Flower? Real quick, before we start this next clip, it will be a bit of a shock. My closet will look like a wreck. But y'all know, I don't live at home anymore. I have my own apartment. So they decided to use my closet as a storage room for Kaylee that you guys see in the video. A lot of her toys and stuff are in my room. That's why my closet looks a mess. If you want to see my closet tour, what it looked like before I moved out, that's how I keep my closet. Not like that. Please don't judge me. <laughs> All right, so my mom just kicked me out the kitchen because she still has stuff to do and she didn't want to share the stove. I think I'm going to go ahead and get ready, but I need to figure out what I'm going to wear. Let me show you my suitcase here's what she's looking like so far i decided not to unpack this time because i'm only gonna be here for a week a lot of which is my work clothes when i come back for winter break we're out for a month so i just decided to bring some of my clothes now here's what we're looking like for thanksgiving i just always dress up for like holidays and i just look so cute just always like to dress up so that's what we're doing i just don't know what to wear I'm leaning towards wearing a dress like a long dress because my legs aren't shaved but i could also wear jeans yeah but there's a lot of different options i packed a lot high neck crop top a flannel with like some dark colored jeans i have two dresses that i've really been dying to wear somewhere and i haven't this one i got i actually hauled i got this freshman year and i have 
never worn it i just thought about that wow because i did a haul for it it was a shein haul and i did it in my dorm so i've had this for a minute and i've never worn it but it's just this nice chocolatey brown mm -mm, good like dress a high neck super cute it's long sleeve and it's long baby when i say long like all the way down to the ankles like super cute i think this would be really cute one to get a picture because i feel like i really want to get a picture today so i might force my boyfriend to take a picture of me i also have these <laughs> boots that could be really cute for a picture like huh so that's a fit also but i also have this dress from shein that i got in one of my more recent packages which i really wanted to do a shein haul this dress is so fire i tried it on in front of my boyfriend and he was like where are we going in that so cute it's giving like skin this gives like that same vibe it's just like one piece of fabric like finely draped over your body it has like stretch so it like fits your curves in all the right places and it just looks so good and the back is back in look at this back with the straps like cross in the back and it's so cute this one's pretty long too it's not as long as the other one but i mean i guess i could make it long like more cleavage the longer it'll get but this is just so good i really didn't like plan this out because i don't have any shoes that i would wear with that dress like those boots i'm just gonna wear for a picture it's literally what i got them for to begin with i've only worn them out like maybe three times but i just don't know what shoes i'll wear after that i could just re-wear the outfit that i wore last night which was also really cute me and my family went to a dinner and these are a super cute fit so i got these jeans from fashion nova they're so cute but they're brand new and y'all know fashion nova jeans and they are brand new they are not the most comfortable so i don't know how much i can eat in these love the white detailing on it i feel like it just adds so much when i say rewear like we only were with them for like maybe two hours because i went to work yesterday so i came home changed into this wore this for two hours and took it off with this sweater that is literally to die for this is from shein Look how cute this sweater is so i love how it like cinches in at the wrist a little more puffy and then it like is tight on the wrist which is really cute and then it's like the exact same on the back those are the options i guess we'll figure out once we get out the shower all right so right now i just got out the shower i'm wearing the skims dress that i was telling you guys about right now i don't know if i am gonna go through wearing this it feels so good and so comfortable on the body but i don't know if i'm going to go with this for sure yet i just figured it's comfortable and i can get ready in it and i'll be fine but it just fits so freaking good i know the lighting probably sucks i'm not gonna walk you guys through my makeup right now because that's not this video is it's like a little a little vlog a little vloggy vlog so i'm gonna like time lapse i guess me getting ready and doing my makeup and also watching a podcast so i think i mean it wouldn't work if i was watching a podcast and trying to tell you guys what i'm doing on my face so i'm just going to slap some makeup on my face then we'll head back downstairs to start cooking hopefully my mom is done because i took my time in the shower my sd card ran out of storage so i had to clean that up really fast but i just have my hair clip back because i was doing my makeup but makeup is done i just did something super simp nothing crazy so we're gonna head downstairs so we can finish cooking actually i feel like like i don't want to get anything on this dress so i think i'm gonna put my pjs back on all right y'all so i'm coming at y'all with a quick little voiceover with it okay we get into it y'all saw i just added some salt and butter into my boiling water for the noodles let that heat up and then i'm putting butter salt pepper garlic powder onion powder paprika some cayenne pepper some flour into a skillet in a saucepan and we're gonna get our cheese sauce going okay to that i'm gonna add a little bit of my heavy whipping cream not all of it and i'm dumping in my noodles let them boil once the water's boiling we're adding in our cheeses i got some velvia cheese i got some cream cheese some mild cheddar some colby cheddar and some sharp cheddar and we're mixing that up and this is going to be what makes our cheese sauce you're going to season it to taste add in heavy whipping cream as you go and let that go ahead and melt down and get it to the right consistency that you want the right taste and flavor i'm also spooning in some spoonfuls of the pasta water to help make that sauce a little creamier that's a quick tip adding some more seasoning as you go along like i said and you're really just going to season it and do everything to taste you can't just add cheese to noodles and call it mac and cheese. You got to season it. Then I'm going to add about half of my noodles once I strain it into the cheese at a time and mix that in to make sure it gets well incorporated. Every single noodle needs to be wet, sopping wet. 
and then I'm gonna pour in the other half and mix that in as well and once again make sure you're mixing it around I'm getting a few clips from my phone to show my boyfriend <laughs> and make sure you taste as you go okay never serve anybody anything that you haven't tasted yourself okay period now you could leave it there but I personally like and my family likes a nice baked mac and cheese so I'm going ahead and pouring it half of it into my little pan what do you call it like a glass pan and then I put a little bit of cheese midway to add a little crispiness in the middle and then I poured in the rest of it and then topped it with some cheese and we're gonna get that nice browning on the top for the cheese I'm nervous, but it's already in the pan, so it is what it is. family is that we are all gonna always have our own moves my parents are divorced so I have my mom to spend thanksgiving with and my dad so my brother's probably gonna go spend thanksgiving with my dad after we eat whatever we want here my sister's gonna go to her girlfriend's house i'm gonna go to my boyfriend's house so we all have our own places that we could go and so we're not gonna be together for long so outfit isn't necessarily for here but i do have on the other dress now it's very similar to the other one it's a little deeper in color very long i think it looks really good and then here is the boot it's kind of hard to see because it's such dark color it's really cute about to go downstairs and eat kind of just eat whenever we don't do like the traditional like sit down at the table and eat together but i'm about to go eat because my boyfriend and his family i need to like touch up my makeup my boyfriend and his family are heading to his aunt's house to eat very soon and i probably won't fall there but he's gonna come and pick me up so i can go with them so i think they said five and it's currently like three something keep in mind i haven't eaten in anything yet today so I am kind of great. Oh I didn't show you all that cheese. This is what it looks like. My plate. I got the microwave it. Mm -hmm. That's cheese good. When I tell y'all this plate was hitting like oh my god and if the food don't make you dance Something not right with it. Somebody didn't put their foot in that shit. Okay, I didn't catch it on camera and I'm so sad that I didn't. But my mom, she was like, this is pretty good. And that's the only approval I needed. But I need to go ahead and end this because I'm gonna head to my boyfriend's family's place. I just ran up the stairs, so that's why I'm like out of breath. And I just have so much food on my stomach. That's pretty much it. Thank you guys for spending Thanksgiving with me. Yeah, I love y'all. See you next time. Mwah. Ooh. I am so full, jeez. There's no way I eat that much. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about?